Hello, welcome to Rad Systems, my name is Tuzik, in this tutorial, we are going to create our first project with Rad System Studio. Before we start, you need to download and install Node.js on your computer, provide internet access to Rad System Studio. Once done, let's start by opening Rad System Studio. Click on Prad Classic Create Project button. Now let's provide a name for our project, I will name it to Project 1. Over here, select the database of your choice, I'm going to choose MariaDB. Make sure you have set up the selected database server locally on your computer device. Click on Create New Database button, provide a name for this database, I'm going to call mine Project 1, now click on Create Database button. Click on the default language option field, and select the language of your choice. You can also click on this checkbox to enable multiple languages. Click on the Project Icon Option field, to select the icon pack of your choice, I will choose Material Icons. If you have a password on your local server, please provide it here, you can leave it empty if you don't. So let's click on Create Project button. Our newly created database has no table, let's create at least one for it. Rad System Studio has already set one for us, but we are going to change it. Click on the Table Name field, Table 1 is by default, let's rename it, you can name it what you like, but I'm going to call it Demography. Alright, let's create fields for our table, we want to collect some data, like name, sex or gender, date of birth, DOB and abbreviation. We can also add more fields like phone number, email address, and many more. Click on the Save Changes button. Now let's publish our project by clicking on Publish button. It's going to take like 2 minutes or more to publish our project for the very first time. After that publishing next time will be matters of seconds. I'm going to minimize our PHP internal server command prompt. Click on Preview and Browser to open project on our system default browser. Let's talk a look at the demography table we created. We can see the fields we created, start from the name, gender, DOB, phone, and email. Let's change the DOB label to date of birth. To do the go back to Rad System Studio. Click on Pages. Click on Demography Table, and click on the List Page, click on DOB Field, on the Field Property, click on Default Label Field, change DOB to Date of Birth. Click on Publish button to publish changes. That's nice, changes have taken effect. Click on Add New, button on the top right. Now let's fill table fields with data. Click on submit button. Awesome, record added successfully. We can go on and add, view, edit or delete more records. Let's save our project. Click on the save project button. Name your project. Once done click save. Our project is saved successfully. Subscribe to our channel for more tutorial videos. Thank you.